no. Saturday at the big house. It's the 117th meeting between Michigan and Ohio State. Both sides know the history, but few know it better than Jim Brandstatter. Jamie Evans caught up with Brandy as he prepares for his final rivalry game at the big house. Jamie. There is so much football history between Michigan and Ohio State. I mean, they've been duking it out for more than a century. This Saturday's game is for all the marbles. It's the greatest rivalry in sport. I don't care about the Yankees and Red Sox. I don't care about UCLA, USC. Jim Brandstatter would know. The offensive lineman was a part of the rivalry from 1969 to 1972 and played for Bo Schembechler. It was the 69 game when the Wolverines took down the number one ranked team in the country. A billion years ago, I played in a game in Ann Arbor when Ohio State came in with Woody Hayes, the greatest college football team ever assembled. There's a picture on Sports Illustrated that says the only competition this Ohio State team had was the Minnesota Vikings of the NFL. We beat them 24-12. After graduation, Brandy began his broadcasting career. Through the years, he's seen some crazy things. He says he can't pick out one game from the rivalry, but he sure can remember moments. Rick Leach scoring, you know, on the option to, to beat Ohio State. Woodson and Boston, David Boston going at it. Uh, and Woodson intercepting a pass in the end zone. This Saturday, everything is on the line. A trip to the Big Ten championship game, a possible spot in the college football playoff, and redemption for Jim Harbaugh, who still hasn't beaten his hated rival as coach. Brandstatter says from his perch in the press box, it's his job to bring the passion and excitement he feels to those listening, and he's done it for 43 years. Can you imagine what you might hear from him in his final broadcast from the big house if the Wolverines can do it and take down the Buckeyes? If I were able to get a victory, or Michigan were able to get a victory over Ohio State this weekend in my final call, not just for me, but for Dan Deardorff also. That would be just that storybook close. In Ann Arbor, Jamie Edmonds, Local 4. Storybook. Yeah. Love it. It's always, it's always epic. Bernie's next with what Ohio State head coach Ryan Day is saying about the game next.